Donald Trump was hoping his trip to Asia would calm the growing global concerns about his unstable behavior since taking office, but it clearly has not convinced Republicans Sen. Bob Corker. According to a report on Wednesday, Corker, who heads the Senate Foreign Relations Committee, has scheduled a hearing for next week on the president's authority to use nuclear weapons. More from the Hill, a number of members both on and off our committee have raised questions about the authorities of the legislative and executive branches with respect to war making, the use of nuclear weapons, and conducting foreign policy overall, Corker said in a statement announcing the November. 14 hearing. This continues a series of hearings to examine these issues and will be the first time since 1976 that this committee or our House counterparts have looked specifically at the authority and process for using U. As nuclear weapons, he continued. This discussion is long overdue and we look forward to examining this critical issue. As The Hill also noted, Corker's hearing to curb Trump's power is among similar moves that have been made by lawmakers in recent months. Democratic members of Congress Ted Lieu and Ed Markey have proposed legislation that would bar any move by Trump to launch a nuclear attack on North Korea and GOP Sen. Dan Sullivan said any move by this president to wage preemptive war would require the authorization of Congress. And of course, Trump's temperament has been a concern since before he was even elected a year ago, but those worries have only increased since he took office. Over the summer, the president added fuel to the fire by telling North Korea they would experience fire and fury like the world has never seen if they continue to pursue a nuclear weapon. GOP sent off B.O.B. Corker, who has correctly said that Trump's unstable and irresponsible behavior is pushing the United States toward World War III, may be retiring at the end of his term, but he's clearly not going quietly 